mananak. Wow! Mananak. Award goes to rider number seven. That's again Lewis Stewart from Kodisan and Kodis Racing. So nakita mo, lumayo na naman kagad. Ito, ito naman, nasa likuran niya si uh, Joel Evans at si Bordok Mangwasong, ang rider number 111 ng Team Pilipinas. Alright, nangunguna pala ng mga Australian riders. Again, they are scheduled for 20 minutes plus two laps. So, this will be a test of Pendura again. So, we're going to see that Burlok Bawaso goes down to fourth. He's kind of the first one. Okay, Evans now on second. Rider number 77, I think that is one lock now on third. So, let's see if he's the first one. Now, 20 minutes is now counting. 20 minutes is now on. Here we go, it's still Stewart on first. So, tingnan po natin ang Congress from Arnie Tevez Hold Shot Award. Yan ang rider number 7 from Kojisan Aussie Racing Team. Stewart. Yan, so pumakalawa ron si Bordok Makosok pero nakuha siya agad siya ni uh, Evans dito sa second uh, corner. Oo nga po. Lumitkit. So, uh, Lewis Stewart is again having a very commanding lead. Over Joel, Joel Evans. So Joel Evans now on second. Followed by runner number 77. By Gerard, who won a lap. Yeah. Oh, wow. What a jump from the Australian and Gerard, who won a lap. So now it's about Evans also having a new line on that first corner. And they didn't even see that 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 So Evans now on second. Sumisida pa! Nakita niya yun guys. Tumitingan pa talaga siya sa likod niya. Doon sa airtime niya, no? Oo, tinitingan niya kung sino yung nasa likod niya. So one o'clock is on third. So also a rider from Thailand Rider. Alright, medyo bumabawi ito si one o'clock na kanina. that vibration na magdumada ang sinasara pa namin yung ibang klase talaga one more sa naman kayo ang audience kayo sa Pilipinas to witness the final of the best of the best of the beat here in Tevez Tevez Park yan we still have the lead from Kojisan on the racing team That's uh, Lewis Stewart. Gerard Wanalak. Gerard Wanalak is on third. Uh, on second is uh, Joel Evans. So Wanalak checking in. Wow. 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 Habang lumili ko ka, nagpe-preno ka, pero umaapasin ka pa rin, no? Ano yun, Coach? Sobrang sana ng tingla, 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 ng t
So, nagtitrip yung kanilang bike. Ay, 
gain the momentum. Ayala, Lewis. Here comes Manala. Here comes Evans. Medyo na mayo na ngayon si Lewis. Dahil uh, medyo dapat siya para wala na sa likodan niya si uh, Joel Evans. Yes, iba na ang lumalaban sa kanya ngayon. But here comes Manala came to the inside. Evans also using that inside line. So we're uh, coming on our halfway mark. It's uh, 10 minutes, 37 seconds remaining. Plus two laps after that 10 minutes mark. Here it comes, one lap. And you're looking at the Lewis. Here it comes, Lewis from Kojisan, Aussie Racing Team. One lap from Team Good Boy Sabo International. Also, Joe Levans from Good Boy Sabo International. We are now down to the halfway mark, 10 minutes remaining. Here at the Femmes Cup Asian Motocross Championship. And Joe Levans still trying to reclaim his spot. His second spot, na kinuha na ni Drudge, one and up. But still, one of them is on a mission, trying to uh, overtake Lewis in front. But we still have our halfway mark. Makikita na lang natin dito kung sino yung mas patagal ang distensya. One of them, using that inside, cutting that berm. Evans on third. These three riders are now overlapping most of the riders inside the track. It's Lewis. One and a half. Evans. Ayan na, medyo lumalapit na si One and a half. Whoa! One and a Whoa! So 
it's still one lock on the lead. Here comes Evans. Alright, humahabong na si Evans. Using the burp. So it's Pornok Pagosong and Rob Gameto is off the back of these two riders battling out for first. Hindi na natin itong pumapangatlo. So medyo malayo yung pangatlo. Oo, coach. Hindi natin ma-identify kung sino ba ang third place nito for the race. Well, hindi ko nakamedyo na pressure dito si Louis Stewart. Si Louis Stewart. Si Louis Stewart. Medyo na pressure kaya nang pwede na maging yung throttle. Causing him to rear slide or front slide yung kanyang bike kaya medyo nawalag siya ng control and medyo mabigat, medyo masakit masakit ang masakit ang nangyari na yun masakit ang nangyari na yun so in 5 minutes 22 seconds remaining it is still Gerard's Walalak from Thailand of Team Good Boy followed by his teammate Joel Evans also from Team Good Boy Sabong International Oh, kinot niya yung ano, Brim, coach! Yup, and we are down to the last five minutes here at the Tevez Epic Park. One a lap! Parang yung nangyari sa race na kahapon for Epic 2. Siya yung nag-lead. Ba't siya naman yung tumaba? Now he is leading the race. Four MX-1 using his gas-gas motorcycle. Alam mo, Kat, malaki ang magyayaring resulta rito, no? Malaki ang magiging pagbabago ng resulta. Because earlier, it was Lewis from the hit one. Siya yung nag-first. Followed by... Joe Evans. So si Joe Evans, pagkakot si Sia to ng second, baka siya yung maging overall dito. So, hindi natin masabi sa points, no? Pero si Wana lang kasi, fifth place naman siya. Ngayon, siya yung mag-first. So, titignan natin kung ano yung pwedeng maging mag-iari. Oo, wala pwedeng mag-iari sa points na ito. But still, he is leading the race. Nabawi niya yung fifth place niya sa Moto1. So, tataas si ranking ni JJ Wana lang. Yes, exactly. So, medyo, ah, Gerard Wana lang pala. Nawala si Lewis Stewart to, kaya medyo mahin. I think he decided to continue. Well, I don't think so kasi parang... Mukhang matindi yung injury. Matindi, oo. Masakit-sakit yung nangyari sa kanya na yun. Tama, Coach. Uboy Antonio, rider number 5 from JMS. Balance Steel Imprint Costume on the racing team. Ito na si Rob Gameto, naka-all white. Iwanan na ng konti ng si Warlock Magoso. So, wala lang ha? We have a lapper, rider number 31. Yes, na-apektohan niya yung discarded ni Gerard Shwanalak. Sumunti ka na sila magbanda ni Joel Evans. Konti na lang. Baka pwede ba sila sumim lang po? Yeah, no. It's what with 2 minutes, 48 seconds remaining on the Tevez MX Park clock. Tingnan natin kung may magagawa pa si Evans dito. Pwede pa niyang i-reclaim yung kanyang position, kanyang rank. So here comes Gerard Walalak and Evans. And rider number 31 is one of the lappers na actually, no? Yun, coach. Kasi minsan, pag andiyan ka na, pag sobrang focus mo na, hindi mo na talaga nakikita yung mga riders na iba sa paligid mo, eh. Joel Evans still eyeing George Wadalak. Oh, George! Yes, kaya nga sa pagkat. Nawalan siya ng momentum ata. Yes, 
Yes, oh, para na neutral yan, para hindi po ton, no? So, now it's uh, Joel Evans. That's a big advantage for Joel Evans. Since kanina pa niya minamatahan si Gerard, one lap. Oo, oh, kanina pa niya chinachari ito, para yes, mahuba ang okay. mga lapit-lapit siya, eh. Pero ngayon, biglang nabaliktad niya yun. So, it's now Gerard, one lap. So, it's now working overtime just to catch up Joel Evans. Grabe. Anything is possible here. Look at the replay. Ay, the replay. So, wala. Talagang na lalus niya yung front end. And then, Joel Evans passes him on that corner. Grabe. So, Mainit ang laban ng natukot. So, we still have 52 <laughs> seconds remaining before we move on to our two laps. Plus two laps. Ayan, overtake niya na si Kubuy uh, Antonio of uh, JMS Man of Steel Imprint Costumes Racing Team. Here we go. Joe Evans. Try to relax with 25 seconds remaining. Ayun, may pagkalayo yung dalawa. Oo, oh, okay, coach, medyo ma ma malayo-layo yung gap nila. Malayo ang ahabulin sa team na lang because of this unexpected na nangyari lang kanina. Five so seconds. Sweet. Ayun na. So, exacto. We are down to our last two laps. Tingnan natin kung makakabawi si Gerard Juana lang. Ayan. Nako, ang ating... K-pop! K-pop na wala sa pwesto! Na wala sa pwesto! But still, he's on second spot. So, medyo makikita natin from 50 seconds. Not bad, right? Eh? Not bad, right? Pero, check natin. It's more of a good fight, di ba? Yes! Ilang minutes din niya, ilang minutes din siya nag-rain as the first race. Now, while Evans made a very commanding lead over Gerard Juanala. May presyo sa rider ni uh, Thailand. Oo. Oh, Part Thailand din. Na, ano na sila, Coach? Siyempre, ito na, yung Heat 2, Moto 2. Yes, yeah, yun uh, pa si uh, Gerard dito. So, yung two laps na to, we can see, or I can uh, forecast or predict that I think uh, Joel Evans will get the first part. Here at the Tevez Autocross Park. This is the final lap. Uh, final two laps for uh, uh, Joel uh, Evans. Medyo lumayo na talaga si Gerard Chua na lap coach. So we have the team good boy uh, position first and second. Uh, one lang, eto, medyo, uh, medyo malayo-layo na coach, no? May 10 second gap sila eh, malayo-layo yes, na yun. Yes, malayo-layo na talaga. Uh, well, uh, two laps na yun. Alright. Joel Evans approaching the Enzo's. Medyo talaga ang kalabang mo rito yung consistency, no? Kailangan mag-consistent yan. Yun talaga, Coach. Eh, ang hirap rin ata maging consistent since 20 minutes yung karera nila. Plus, two laps. Ito, we're down to the final lap. And, di pa natin nakikita sa screen si Gerard Chuanala. So, we are predicting that Joel Evans will secure the first place for Heat 2. Uh, earlier, we, uh, he uh, got second spot. Second spot. Now, we are in uh, the East of first place. So, maliwanan. Ay, kita natin. Uh, <laughs> para kay Joel Evans. Ayun na si Gerard. Medyo talaga nag-slow down na siya. Slow down na rin siya. And approaching the Enzo Sleep. Ladies and gentlemen, your Moto 2 champion, rider number 81, 